guys, what's up? It's your commissioner speaking. And yes, I'm super late today. It's Tuesday evening. It's about 6.53, almost 7. Um, I had a really, really busy day, so... But I'm here just for you. <laughs> Alright guys, so... Uh, several high scoring games, not as much as last week, but uh, definitely doable and uh, very exciting as well. My Raiders lost, sadly, but... Uh, Anyway, you know, that has to come against the uh, Kansas City Chiefs anyway. You can't really assume they're going to win that game. But still looking good for the Raiders, no bad. Oh, some props to the Niners. The Niners are actually doing pretty legit. I'm pretty surprised. Maybe once the Raiders move to Vegas, I'm telling you. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't. I can't be a 49er fan, sorry. <laughs> but anyways, guys, uh, let's get right to it. Let's go ahead and see or... Uh, Highest players or the highest scoring players this week. Uh, starting with a quarterback. Check it out. All right. So yeah, Mr. Patrick Mahomes again. Uh, Sixty-seven point one two. Mr. Cody's four hundred forty-three yards and four touchdowns out against my Raiders. But that's okay. You know, my home's supposed to do my home thing, so that's definitely one of those things. All right, so let's go right on to our running back. Check it out. That is right, Mr. Dalvin Cook. 154 yards, one touchdown, and three receptions. For 49 points so Aaron you're up on the uh, on, on the uh, the name drops again all right so that's pretty good keep it up uh, check out a uh, wide receiver this week uh, I was I, I did not even know who this guy was until last week check it out <laughs> Marcus Robinson. Well, I want to say he's the uh, uh, Kansas City Chief wide receiver. Uh, last week we had, uh, what was his name? Sammy Watkins, right? So now another Kansas City Chief receiver made it this week. So this one's obviously a free agent. Nobody has him. So I'm pretty sure Michigan's putting waivers for him. Well, you never know, right? Because Sammy Watkins was the top last week and he wasn't this week. So, it's a hit or miss, but uh, yeah, free agent, 172 yards, two touchdowns, 43 points. So, if you need a receiver, might be a good one to pick up, okay? All right, check out our tight end. Yep, Mark. Andrews. So I believe that is Teresa's uh, tight end. Uh, so that's a great pickup for her. 112 yards, one touchdown, 29 points. Pretty good. Teresa's coming on up, man. I'm telling you. Since before the season started, I said Teresa had one of my favorite games. Favorite games. Favorite teams. And she's definitely showing the signs of uh, what the potential would be towards the end of the season. All right. Ooh, another weird one. Check out the kicker this week. Eddie Pinero. Who the hell is that guy? He's apparently the kicker, the kicker, the Bears' new kicker. Uh, he had uh, one extra point and three field goals for 19 points. Free agent, nobody's got him. Uh, so they made a big fuss about him because he actually made a game winning field goal. <laughs> Unlike last year, what was it, Cody? Cody Parkey, I think it was. He missed like five field goals and they lost the game. But yeah, I guess the Bears got a kicker. Not bad. And last but not least, check out the crazy defense. That's right, 
freaking Patriots. Seven sacks, four interceptions, two defensive touchdowns for a whopping 70 freaking fantasy points. Damn. Michael, doing it again, man. You guys are hot. So, yeah, so Patriots, number one defense this week. So, hopefully, uh, you guys were name dropped in there. Mine was not there again, so it's it's okay. I'll, I'll get my players up there one day. Not, not a problem. It's only week two. <laughs> All right, guys, so that was uh, definitely uh, our top players this week. However, I want to cover something a little special this week. I know it's only uh, week two, but I want to tell you guys our top three players in each position. And some of those names, that's why I want to tell you, some of those names are kind of kind of out of the, out of the water. So for our top three, let me give you a link intro for that one. That's right. So our top three players in each position. Quarterback Mahomes, Lamar Jackson, and Dak Prescott. All right. So we know about Mahomes. He should have been number one anyway. Uh, but uh, that, that Prescott, most people did not even draft Dress Prescott. But in our, obviously in our league, we did draft him. But that's, that's not bad. Uh, for running backs, Dalvin Cook, Austin Eckler, and Derek Henry. Those are our top three running backs in our league. Obviously, Dalvin Cook is a high, uh, uh, highly drafted person, right? But Eckler, he was supposed to be just a backup. And Derek Henry, there was a potential, but he's top three right now. Uh, oh, wide receivers, John Ross, really? He just got picked off the waivers last week. And he's our number one receiver in our league. Mr. Sammy Watkins. And uh, Marquise Brown, the dude from uh, the Ravens. So that's pretty good. Uh, tight end, Mark Andrews. So the same as our, uh, you know, highlight this week. Uh, Evan Ingram and Travis Kelsey. So those two other names are pretty uh, common. Those should have been there. Uh, our kicker, Joy Sly. I guess the Panthers kicker, right? I don't know much about him. Justin Tucker and Will Lutz. So those are two veteran uh, players. And lastly, the Patriots, the Niners, and the Titans are our best defense. Do you have any of those? Because uh, I don't think none of those are mine. <laughs> So, oh well, well, if you got some of those players, those are the top three players in, uh, in our league right now. All right, guys, so moving on up, check out, ooh, <laughs> let's go on and show you guys our most valuable team this week, along with the runner-up and, and our beautiful donkey award. All right, guys, check it out. Truly, thank you very much. I beat Teresa by point one to get that MVT, and I had no idea freaking Beckham, that crazy 89-yard touchdown run, that gave me a gazillion points, and that just made me go above Teresa. So, hey, that's right. Commissioner, number one this week. <laughs> but, yeah, so besides that, you guys, good week. We have a... Several good matchups again. Gabriel's got another hard ma matchup, this time against Aaron, I believe, if I remember correctly. So, thank you for tuning in. We have, uh, obviously, uh, a couple changes. We have uh, four undefeated teams remaining already. It's only four. Uh, 
And then our power rankings are doing pretty decent. Obviously, the top three remain the same top three as uh, last week. So keep it up, you guys. And uh, this concludes my video this week. So hopefully you guys like it. I know it's late. Uh, make sure you guys put in your waiver wire tonight. And if you're watching this on Wednesday, hopefully you got the waiver wire people you wanted. Uh, for now, uh, good luck this week. All right? Peace out.